Well, <laughs> here I am in my comfy little PJs in the comfort of my own little home just to give you a new review of a product I just purchased from Aldi's for the sake of my allergies and possibly sleep apnea, but we'll see. So it's called the Crane Sinus Inhaler and it claims you're supposed to use it in 30 minute treatments and it claims that uh, it's adjustable Steve Comfort 99.99 .99 germ free steam vapor pad tray and it's for allergies ding 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 cold and flu nasal congestion and sinus irritation which I have all of those in case you're wondering why I'm out of breath I was getting all these things set up and ready so I'm gonna give this a try because what you don't know is every single morning I wake up with my face swollen, my eyes completely swollen, um, my tops of my eyes literally hang over my lids. So I'm kind of clueless right now. I'm sure it's one of two one of two things, either and or, either my allergies or and my sleep apnea. I don't know which because unfortunately in Buffalo, New York, I can't seem to see a doctor without a mask on. And I don't know what doctor requires somebody who has breathing issues to cover their only breathing apparatuses. So I have tried everything under the sun. I have tried your Benadryl. This is generic, which knocks the crap out of me. And then when I wake up, I feel like crap. Um, I try the non-drowsy allergy relief, which really does nothing for me whatsoever. Uh, I. <laughs> have a trusty little sleeping mask that I use in the daytime when I really need to get some sleep because I didn't get any very good sleep at night. Every night before I go to bed, I use saline solution, which definitely helps, but it's not a cure-all. I still have these problems, but this is really good stuff. I highly recommend it. Recommend it. I believe I got this in Family Dollar for about six bucks. And then, of course, my trusty little mouth guard that I use for my sleep apnea. You've seen those videos before. If not, take a look around in my Joanne's Inspirational Videos and Reviews channel and you can see the review I did on these mouth guards for sleep apnea. And last <laughs> but not least, oh great, my cat's got a fur ball going on over there. <laughs> that was my cat. This is from Wish. This is a little... You okay, kitty? Nice time to have a fur ball going on. Okay, um, so this is an apparatus you put in your nose. It's a snore guard. You put it in your nose, super easy, super comfortable. And yes, this definitely helps with sleep apnea. Poor kitty. But again, it's not a cure-all. So, I bought this little crane. And I don't know how many of you have a, um, what do you call this? A steamer that you use for your allergies or what brands they are uh, or what price ranges so if you can leave in the comments below box below what type of inhaler you use what's the cost of it and does it work for your allergies and also I'm kind of wondering is anybody out there does as anybody else out there have a problem with their eyes swelling my cheeks do too sometimes my whole face but mostly my top eyelids swell and they hang down over my um, bottom lid. So if anybody else is out there has the same problem I do, please let me know. I'm going to try this out and see how it goes. Also, I thought the interesting thing was, here it is. It's pretty hot. This is the Crane Sinus Inhaler. And it blinks when it's getting ready. Blinks green when it's getting ready. And it's solid when it's ready. You can see it's just starting to steam. And also there's a little compartment in here, which I don't know if I should take out while I'm doing that or not. Yeah, see, that's the problem. Getting it back in. I'm a little scared about that. Um, there we go. I got it. So that little compartment right there is for this little um, infuser. Which, by the way, the, the directions are pretty interesting. 
The directions say don't put any medication or um, essential oils in here. But that's what this is. So I'm guessing it's a pad. It's a soaked pad. So I'm guessing you could re-soak it with essential oil. But else it says don't use your own pets um, because certain scent essential oils are not good. And also um, it says not to use if you have epilepsy. Um, <laughs> okay, noted, duly noted, I had epilepsy till I was 18 years old until the day that the Lord saved me when I was 18. And I no longer had another seizure. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. So praise you God on that one. So anyways, um, I don't know why it says you can't use it if you have epilepsy, but I haven't, you know, had epilepsy in, oof, I don't want to give away my years. Let's just say about 25 or so years, maybe a little more. So at any rate, um, this is the crane. There is a low and high speed on it. It looks like it's starting to get going, but it hasn't turned solid yet. And when it turns red, it's supposed to be empty and you need to refill it. Also, the directions say you're not supposed to put your... Okay, peeps, did you miss me? <laughs> I'm so sorry. My last video cut off after I gave a full demonstration of this crane sinus inhaler. Uh, so I'm redoing it for you. I'm just going to attach this video to the other one. Unfortunately, I did not get good reviews. I also took the infuser out of the compartment here to show you because I was gagging on it. It was so potent, there's no way I could use it. So I took it out, it slips in there. Um, whew, even on my fingers, too much. At any rate, uh, the directions say that you're supposed to put your face on it but don't let your face touch the mask so that's what i did i let this oh see right here it gets hot it's this thing comes out here so you cannot con conveniently hold this thing uh so you have to hold it by the base which is kind of uncomfortable and not natural uh so that's not real cool and uh the other thing was that I ran this for five minutes and it ran out of steam after five minutes and you're supposed to use it for 30. So as far as I'm concerned, this did nothing for me. I mean, if I could have ran it for 30 minutes, great, but uh, you might as well just run a pot of water and I mean, there's no difference between this and boiling water, though you wouldn't want to put your face over a pot of boiling water. So I, I, I am not approving of this. It's way too hot. Um, it's still blinking, which means it's not even ready yet, and the steam's coming out adequately. It's supposed to be a solid green when it's ready, um, but when this did turn a solid green in the other video, it ran out of steam. <laughs> so, let me know what you think in the comments, okay? Do you have a, is this called a vaporizer? It's, it's called a sinus inhaler. Do you have a sinus inhaler? Really, it's a vaporizer. If so, how much did you pay for it? I got this at Aldi's for 25 bucks. And unfortunately, I was hoping this would work for my allergies and sleep apnea, that it would be a dual method there. But I am going to return her because I don't think this is too uh, safe, to be honest with you. Again, it's super hot, it gets hot as hell. You can't hold it. You and look at this, you practically burn yourself. Look at it, it's run out of steam already. And in the other video, since I had since the video shut off on me, I waited till this cooled down and I opened it up. I thought, is it out of water already? No, it's full of water still. Okay, so there is a level on here, a low and a high. Let me adjust that. Let me see where we are here. Maybe I'm on the low and didn't realize it. No, I was on the high. This is barely steaming, guys. I mean, yeah, it's steaming, but ow! See, it's 
See, I burned my finger right there on the steam coming out here, right there. So you can't na hold it in a natural phase. You're not supposed to put your face right on it, but I'm not getting anything out of it. Hello. <laughs> Train si sinus inhaler, take three. I'm so sorry. My video got cut off. Um, thanks, Google. Even though I bought 100 gigabytes, uh, apparently my storage was full and I had to empty my trash. So, lesson learned today. I actually thought that maybe it was my battery in my phone, uh, but it wasn't. It was Google Photos. So I emptied my trash, and this is video three. I am adding to my original videos that I was doing about my crane sinus inhaler. So after I fully reviewed this in two other videos that you didn't get to see, because <laughs> it shut off on me, I cannot recommend this crane sinus inhaler because one this is how you would comfortably hold it this is how it naturally fits in your hand but unfortunately you know as you're as you're doing this uh whoo see and I just burned my hand so you can't hold it comfortably um let me come up higher so you can see my face and and, and everything uh, and this is how you'd have to hold it. You'd have to hold it from the bottom. Because not really natural. You could probably get used to it, but it's more comfortable to do this. But you're going to burn your hands. And this, this shaft is hot as you know what. It's super hot to touch. So that is, this is not safe. I'm returning this. Again, I bought it at Aldi's for 25 bucks. Um... I'm returning it. I was hoping it would help me with my allergies, with my swollen eyes, and my sleep apnea, or at least my swollen eyes. Um, but unfortunately, it also runs out of steam after five minutes. And again, the light's blinking, so it's supposedly not ready yet, but it is ready because it's got the most steam when it's blinking. Oh, see? I'm, I'm burning my finger again. And you're supposed to use it for a half an hour, but I can't use it for a half an hour because it runs out of steam and it burns my fingers. So, and the shaft is super hot. Uh, even with the adjustment on here, it doesn't make any difference. And this remains super hot for like 15 minutes, even after you shut it off. So, I can't recommend this. Let me know if you find that this, val this video is valuable to you so that... I could either, you know, so that you could either not purchase this or purchase it. That's up to you. Um, but I'm trying to give you an honest review so you know what to buy, what not to buy, the price I paid for it, where I got it from, all these 25 bucks. It's a crane. It's a sinus inhaler. Uh, you know, if you like it, if you find it valuable, give me a thumbs up if you don't mind. And if you want to see some more videos and reviews, subscribe to my channel. And then this way you'll be able to see my upcoming videos. I do have some more in line that I'm going to be reviewing, some other products. So stay tuned and thanks for watching.